What's up guys, this is Gesture of None and welcome back to the forest. So, uh, let's get started. We need to finish off our drying rack, otherwise we're going to have a big of a food problem soon. And then I'd really like to set up some more sustainable food. Like, um, it would be good to get a... Oh, bunny, 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 bunny. Well, it would be good to get a bunny. I'm just going to turn my audio down because it's a bit crazy. Okay, that should be better. So, we need to begin to get a uh, little garden so that we don't have to worry about food. I mean, the garden's great. I mean, you put it down and basically every time you use it, you will, you know you'll have food the next day or so. If you have two gardens, you're basically set for a long time. And you can collect berries for uh, other stuff too, like we need berries for paint and stuff. Although I've never actually used paint. Um, I know that you use it for the target thing and I probably could use a target. I'm, um, I'm very bad at throwing my spear. So, um, yeah, maybe we'll think about making a target soon. Uh, if we get enough bunny rabbits, we can make a, uh, what are they called? Oh, yeah, a berry pouch, and then we can make paint, But which is weird. It's same strange that you can't just put it straight in your inventory. And we have some edible berries here, so that's pretty good. And, um, yeah, we'll be also be able to make, I think they introduced some new stuff. I think you can walk into the sinkhole now. Um, which is not really a feature I was looking for, but it's definitely a needed feature. It's silly that it has uh, barriers. You know, players should be stupid enough to walk to their death if they really want to. Um, and I probably will at some point. Um, yeah, they introduced some new features, and I guess we're going to have a, an explore of some of those at some point in the series. But I don't think there's any uh, major urge to get around to any of them now. So this can all be put on the fire. By fire, of course, I mean drying rack. Apparently this attracts cannibals, which really makes sense. But... Um, I don't really mind. I mean, we're fighting them only in the day, so it's a shame I can't put this on in mass. It'd be good if they updated the inventory system a little bit so that we could uh, just like select this, like a chest in Minecraft or something similar, and then um, build it out using that. Like, um, just fill in the chest and then it'll all be put automatically in the inventory. Okay, we need 11 more sticks. And we should also build a water gathering thing. I've got the build button there for a second. And water and gathering thing, I guess I mean a water collector. Actually, do you know what? That wasn't far off. We're going to put it up here because I think it'll look nice. Maybe it'll ruin our view though. And we may as well put food and water next to each other, right? So we'll put it there. Just have this floating turtle shell for a little while and we can get... Is that a bunny? Yes, it was. Good. Oh, another one. We seem to be... Um, we have plenty of bunnies in our current position, which is always a good thing. It seems like uh, usually I set up kind of far away from the um, kind of far away from the forests, but um, just for, you know for the extra safety. But setting up near the forest seems to be great. You have a, an abundance of resources. Uh, maybe we'll make some stealth armor pretty soon. I mean, we're not being really stealthy because we're not playing on the the version of the game that would sort of require stealth. We're not playing with enemies on during the day and I guess pretty soon we'll have to turn them on maybe uh, you can let me know in the comments and there will be comments this time I have just started uploading these videos live so I'm filming this um, the day before episode one releases and that's that's how I film I, I schedule it so that um, I schedule it so that my videos only come out yeah, well, when my video comes out I film the one after the one that's going to come out next if that makes sense so that I'll never run up against time I don't want to be have to be forcing videos out i want to get them out happily and, and with pleasure and so that they come out as, as good as possible as, uh, as clean as possible and as enjoyable as possible so um let me know in the comments i guess if there's anything you want to see um because now there will be comments you will not see your feedback god we're really close to the plane aren't we oh wow i remember running around for hours trying to find a tree and there was one over there um oh well uh, yes, there will be comments, but you will not see your the results of your comments until approximately a week, uh, two weeks, no, a week. Um, still, I am there. I'm listening, and uh, you will hear that if you leave a comment. For example, if you're one of the, the strange people who is listening to me now, um, as I'm releasing this, or rather when I've just started, then you will get your feedback from your comments pretty soon because. Uh, episode 1 goes up tomorrow, if you happen to see that around the time it uploads, then you will be in episode uh, 4. But other than that, I think, uh, you know, give it a while. And I'm still learning, you know. Um, so have we got enough sticks? No, we need a few more sticks. We'll put these up there, and then we'll go out further, a bit further afield to try and gather. We got distracted by the plane, and by 
talking about stuff. Oh, I thought we needed another deer skin. Four sticks, and we'll have a bed. Hopefully it'll rain soon and we can get some water. Uh, I'm going to build a sap collector on a nearby tree. I mean, it doesn't make sense not to because, uh, well, we have the pot and uh, we need the sap. And we're not planning on cutting down any of these nearby trees. I guess it doesn't make a difference whether we use a, a big tree or a little tree. We just need one stick, that's fine. Collect five sticks. I'm just going to hold E, I guess, and walk around. Oh, lizard. Come here. I get, I get so distracted by the opportunity to kill something. I think in one of the previous episodes, almost definitely in one of the previous episodes, I was talking about my desire to not kill things like this little bit. I'm um, kind of torn between killing them for the resources and not killing them. But I, I do feel that. I am... I'm, I'm a little bit bothered sometimes when I kill things in this game. But on the other hand, I also am eager to get as much resources as possible. I would like to completely own all of these uh, natives and cannibals. And uh, <laughs> I'll kill whatever it takes, apparently. Um, I guess this game teaches you some stuff about yourself too. Okay, good. Right, uh, let's take these back to our hole. And by hole, I mean tree. I don't know why I said hole. I've realised from playing this game a lot, or from doing Let's Plays, I say um, the phrase, and by this I mean that, quite a lot. Uh, I'm going to try and work on that, because, uh, although I suppose there's no, I mean, you're going to use some phrases a little bit more than other phrases. There we go, we can save now. You're going to use some phrases a little bit more than other phrases, and it's just basically arbitrary. We can destroy this, which is good, I want to destroy it, it's, um, I built it off camera so it doesn't technically exist. Go on, fuck off. Get back in your ground where you belong. Uh, is it even going? Am I attacking this by accident? Oh, it is going. I can see that I've got to... It wants me to repair it. Take your time. Isn't this supposed to be... There you go. Good. All gone. It's a shame I can't recover the resources. It seems like you should be able to, but whatever. Uh, let's build some gardens. We're trying not to chop down too many trees. I'm going to take one so that this area doesn't get too thin. I'm going to take one from a bit further away. Now, I seem to remember that you can chop down trees a little bit more efficiently by walking around them. But that is only if you manage to actually hit them. And we didn't seem to be able to. Is it falling? Sometimes it's hard to tell. There we go. Okay, that's enough for... Oh, wow. Look at that. <laughs> that's crazy. I've got a little bird tornado. Well, I'll kill him. A lot of feathers from that. That was crazy. There's another one. Well, this one seems to be broken. <laughs> Is that cheating? I mean, i got a lot of feathers. Can we carry any more feathers? That was really great. I needed feathers to make arrows, and I'm going to have a bow and arrow soon, I guess, as well. And we've got more meat. Good. I, I didn't realise the birds gave meat again. There must have been... Uh, I think they fixed that problem, I guess. Uh, yes. We wanted to build gardens. It's in food, I guess. Oh, there they are. Where shall we have our gardens? I, I, I like. It's nice and flat here. I like the idea of them being amongst the... Uh, amongst the uh, roots of the tree giving back to nature apart from that we're going to rip this nature up and eat it at some point pretty soon and I'm going to build the other one before we uh, go ahead and plant it's a shame you can't control what seeds are in each as well um, or maybe you can, I don't know let me know if you, if you, if you think you can where is the answer? it's cool that gardens only um, a very small investment of resources you cut down two trees, or one tree rather and you've got um, oh, I'll drop these I'll drop both of them, rather than just one. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's just two two trees and you've got a nice little garden set up. And now we can plant. It's weird. Can't plant the other one. Let's drop some meat. Oh, I see. I was picking up meat, and I must not have seeds. I see. The thing I was... I wasn't planting. I was picking up meat. It did look like... Uh... Can I put more on? Hmm. 
Maybe I'm not actually holding it. Yeah, maybe it's bugged. Um, I don't know what to do with that then because I can't seem to put it on here. Or maybe the drying rack is full. It doesn't seem like it. It seems like these have been going on perfectly fine. Yeah, okay, well then. Drying rack's fine. There just must be just some sort of error. Lovely, we've got a water skin now. That was a bit impromptu, but... Um, how many leaves is it? Lovely. Um, I just thought I might as well craft these things while I'm here. And can we upgrade our spear? No, we can't. We should upgrade our axe, though. I mean, why not, right? You can do mass upgrades of the axe, can't you? <laughs> it's, it's so strange to think that having these little tiny teeth on this very modern axe will make any difference whatsoever. But, um, I mean, that's the... I believe in the game. Oh, we're going to have a bird interaction. Oh, I want to kill you and take your feathers. Oh, okay. And I'm <laughs> literally holding, I was holding bird flesh in my hand as I, uh, as I, as I met with, I don't know if that was the right word, probably wasn't, as I met with that cute little bird. Hello, Franklin. How are you doing, Franklin, my buddy? You okay? Yeah, enjoying the view? I mean, if you're going to be killed and put on a stick, you probably want to do it in such a beautiful area. Um, so what, oh yeah, we need to gather seeds for that. We need a... Uh, rabbit skin pouch, so we need more rabbit. So let's kill some rabbits. I've never successfully gotten the breeding in this game, the, the rabbit breeding, to work. So we're just going to kill them from the wild. There you go, that's finished now. Um, well, I think I'll just chase it and then spike it. Why aren't I... Hey, I couldn't run, I've forgotten how to run briefly. Okay, we don't. We're not going to pick up the corp. Uh, no, I think you have to pick up the corpse because otherwise they'll. Um, do rabbit corpses left everywhere attract cannibals? It would make sense that they do, right? I mean, if a if a drying rack attracts cannibals, then a a rabbit corpse should attract cannibals even more. Need more rabbits. How much is it for the pouch? Oh, just two. Okay. Well then, let's uh, go up to where we saw a. Um, I think you need the pouch to collect seeds. I might actually be wrong and I just happened to not have collected any seeds. But anyway, we saw a... Uh, we saw a berry tree, a bush, berry bush. Somewhere around here, didn't we? Because I remember we ate some. Maybe there's no berries on it and that's why I'm not noticing it. Or maybe I'm just rubbish and I've walked past it six times. Well, I guess we'll wait for the opportunity to uh, collect some berries. We are going to crack into some of these. I mean, why not? They're a renewable resource, apparently, because they um, I think they respawn. Well, we should have had our spear on to do that. Because we want to make the, the uh, rabbit boots. I actually feel like this is one of the most efficient ways to kill rabbits um, in this game, obviously. Um, because they... Otherwise, I mean, they're too fast. For, I feel like they're too fast for arrows. Uh, or maybe I'm just not very good. I'm not a very good shot. Can't carry any more meds. Well, we don't collect any more meds then. Um, yeah, I mean, they're, they're, you can't throw the spear at them. They're, there it is. Can't throw the spear at them. They're kind of too small. Let's collect some. Uh, do I just eat and then they... Ah, there you go. Okay, good. And I think that'll give us some seeds as well. Either way, I mean, it's not a bad thing to have berries. And I think you can hold an infinite amount of them. Hard to see because I think I think it's to do with my settings. They they don't spawn in until you're quite close. Uh, okay, right. We might have enough rabbit skin for the rabbit fur boots. Well, apparently not. We've only got one skin. We killed three rabbits. I guess we use the other ones for the pouch. I think this will give us some thirst, won't it? Yeah, that's perfect. Means we don't have to eat uh, drink the soda anymore. We'll save that for when we go caving, and we are going to go caving, but we're not doing it until I've turned the um, 
daytime spawns of monsters on of the cannonballs on because i feel like it's cheating to go in the caves there's so much good resources down there but it's also supposed to be quite hard otherwise you're just just going in there and picking stuff up which is not what it should be i like that it's uh, scary so i mean we probably should sleep but i'm going to sleep so it's night time i mean we haven't slept in this game yet so i'm going to sleep so that it's night time uh and then we're going to give some uh, do some fighting Maybe we can take the opportunity to build a bone holder. I think we lost a lot of bones because we didn't do that last time. Let's build a, a bone holder first. Uh, it'll be somewhere around here, right? Do do do. Yeah, bone holder, bone basket. Um, we will just put that nestled in amongst our tree. Oop. I think I seem to remember this takes a crazy amount of. Um, we're not gonna put it there. That's how we get in our tree. Maybe we should have a little resource area over here. Um, I'm stressing so much over where to put this bone holder. Let's just put it here. I seem to remember it takes a crazy amount of sticks to... Uh, yeah, a bone holder is 25 sticks. That's nuts. Nuts. Absolutely nuts. Now, there were lots of those tall, tall, thin trees that you can cut into sticks over here, weren't there? Yeah, they were. It's just a much more efficient way of getting sticks. Do these respawn? I mean, I've seen them pop up. Uh, like, not, not seen them pop up, but I've been to areas and other games where... Um, other versions of this game, other me playing this game, not other games that wouldn't be related. Um, I've seen, I've gone to areas where I thought there was no sticks and had more of these things pop up. So I guess that sticks, those those like weird stick trees respawn, um, which would make sense. I mean, they, theoretically, we're here for a long time. I mean, you, you don't build something like this over days, even though they're represented as days. Theoretically, I think it's, um, let's say, months and months. I just pick up that stick. Um, uh, actually, in terms of min-maxing, I should have left that stick on the floor and come back, filled up with sticks over here, collected more, gone back, filled my thing up, and then uh, picked that one up to while we're over there. But hey, we're not much of a min-maxer, really. I'm just a do my bester. Do my bester. Do my bester. Um, yeah, we've got enough now. And then we're going to kill some cannibals and fill it up with bones, which is uh, always helpful. Bones are pretty cool. I think you can make... Um, well, firstly, you've got the bone armor, but also you can make bone walls. And I think the cannibals take that as a sign of aggression. Yeah, there we go. We have got some bones. Okay, good. Uh, are we hungry? Oh, there was a bit of a lag there. I think I guess that was cannibals spawning. Do we have some seeds to plant now? It's strange that we can't plant any seeds. <laughs> Don't know why I keep trying to pick up the mate. Oh, isn't that lovely? Beautiful. So I'm going to put some fires up, some um, like permanent torches so that we can see better at night. I'm pretty sure we're going to get an armsy soon and we will deal with that how we deal with it. But it'll probably involve running away from our base and handling it somewhere else because I really don't want to destroy our base. Is that a stick? Oh no, it's a sap to be collected. Okay, that's one stick. I think these are permanent. Yep, that's some nice permanent lighting for us. And we'll build another one. We've got we've got those skulls and we're gonna get more skulls. And we can we can actually build these in our tree, so we're gonna be doing that. You can't build You can't build um What is that? Oh, it's a little fire. Great. Oh, and there's some ashes in it as well. There's some uh, food left in it. Um, yeah, you can't build... Come here. Come here. Come here. Well, you can't build the lanterns hanging from the tree, which is a shame because I think that would be pretty cool. You can build these uh, skulls on, lan on lanterns. Skulls on sticks. And then on top of those, you can place uh, other stuff like trophy heads, which is a bit strange. I don't know why that, that is enabled. It's probably a bug. Or you could, last time I checked... It may have changed since. Um, we're not being particularly sneaky here because I think we can handle any cannibals. But then again, this may be the time when they kill us and we die. Uh, and we end up in the cave. Okay. But if we do end up in the cave, it'll be an opportunity to get some stuff out of the cave. Because the well, I only want to go in the caves when there are creatures in there. Like for the sake of fairness, like I talked about. But um, at night there will be creatures in there. So I don't feel like it's cheating at all. Okay, good. We're all good on resources. Let's get back to our home. 
The other advantage to killing an armsy away from my home is that it'll take out some of the trees that we... Um, and we can use them for other things, I think. I've never actually fought an armsy because I'm too scared of them. I just run away. But I'm going to do it on, on camera because I want you guys to think I'm tough. Um, I've never actually fought an armsy. Can I just destroy that? It's just that it's in a weird place. I'm going to end up destroying my, my lantern. I really thought you could destroy fires. I'm just going to set it on fire again so that it burns out. Okay, because it's, it's just it's in a weird place. Or maybe I think it's our fault for putting our skull in a weird place. Okay, we've got some lighting. That's pretty nice. Maybe we'll make... Um, I thought I had something. Maybe we'll make... Um, yeah, let's go up our tree and see about making some changes. Right, so I know that you can build... Let's just try. I know that... I don't think I've ever gotten the opportunity. Like, it's never said, build this here. So, no, I don't think so. Nope. But we can build these. Admittedly at weird angles. I mean, you have to walk around and try and find something that's not weird. But off of these, we can also build other things. There you go. And you can see it's not even actually on the base. It's just in the tree. The tree, for some reason, it will accept placing these on it. But um, that's about it. Let's get some more sticks. Ooh, I freaked out a little bit from the from Franklin there. I don't know why for once I'm using our... Oh my god. That's why I don't ever use it. Because it's a pain in the ass. Yeah, I freaked out a little bit because of Franklin there. I thought he was an enemy. Uh, come on, I'm trying to eat something. Good. Need some water soon, but I need it to rain. Or we can go and boil some water from a pond. Up. Okay, I'm going to flee to the tree because we have the opportunity. And then we can gauge who's there. How many of them are there. And then we're going to come down and fight them. No more cowardly hiding in the tree until I want to. Is basically the, uh, the structure of this situation. <laughs> Lovely full moon though, so we can see a bit better tonight, which is whoop, 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 which is nice. And we've got our tree bed finished. I wish we could put a platform up here. Um, I know we can build platforms on the cliffs now. In fact, I wonder if those cliff platforms can be built on. Uh, I don't know what they look like. I've never seen them yet. Oh, that looks like it was it. No, that's catapult. Um, yeah, I know you can build cliff catapults, cliff, cliff, cliff uh, things, things on the cliff side lodging platforms um i wonder if that allow us to build them on a tree but i actually can't see any maybe it's just that you can place platforms on the edge of it on a wall now and they don't, don't need supporting wooden path yeah it must just be that you can place it on the wall now and it doesn't need supporting so um we're gonna pretty up our area by building some of these things soon where did that guy go then? We ran up here away from him. Maybe he didn't see us. Or maybe he's gone to warn his compatriots. Uh, it could probably be that. And we're probably going to get more because we chickened out and didn't kill him. Oops. We are in our floor. So we're coming down apparently. It's a really lovely, lovely night. I mean, you can see really far. Isn't that lovely? Nice quiet night. It's still. Okay, well, let's go and collect some resources if we're not going to be attacked. Um, I'm going to drink soda because I need the thirst and um, apparently we're not getting water tonight. When we do, we'll fill up our skin and then uh, our, our water skin. And then we'll let the, 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 the shell, turtle shell, forgot the word shell. We'll let the turtle shell refill. Good. That's what we needed. Another one here. Oh, we need tree sap. Uh, we can get that. Didn't I, I didn't actually notice that you need tree sap for these things. Well, I think I mentioned it actually, but I didn't cognize it. Probably shouldn't take the... Uh, oh. Bunny rabbit, bunny rabbit, bunny rabbit. They're so hard to catch. How we get back to our house just so we're in less of an open area Oof. I saw some lighting around our house and I thought it was one of the guys with the torch with the with the torch you know they um the commanders the leaders 
the head honchos, the um, king, Tutan, Carmoons. Uh, probably pick up another pot and make another sap collector. Otherwise, we're only going to get sap from cutting down trees. Um, I'd like to make a brick, a stone wall, because I think they look nice. But, um... Hmm. Wait. Stone walls are... Stone walls are there. Yeah, I mean, I'd like to make one. Let's just put one down and see how, how, how much stone it would cost. I don't know where we put one, though. That's the thing. I mean, obviously, we want to sort of protect our little tree home. But, I mean, there's no need for it, really. I, I want one, but I just can't see a purpose. Maybe here, maybe in the tree root. And we'll just have it coming out a little bit to to find the area that is our home. I mean, let's... let's Oh yeah, we go. We can just surround the garden a little bit. That'd be nice. Um, yeah, we'll leave it like that. Forty-four rocks. You know what? We can just dump our rocks into here. It'll be a nice, a nice way of using the rocks that we collect randomly. Like we, we pick up what rocks just walking along. Um, and we can uh, just chuck them in whenever we have too many and then we'll keep on looking for um, resources I think we're looking for a fight right now like I'd like to collect some more bones I'm gonna try and kite them back to uh, the base first uh, unless there's an armsy like I said I'm gonna try and count kite them back to the oh, no, no more rocks I'm gonna try and kite them back to the base so that we can um, just we don't have to carry the bodies miles before we uh, use them but um, other than that we just pick up some rocks. God, surprisingly still night. Did I accidentally put it on uh, vegan mode? I didn't because I just I saw one earlier. An enemy. Lots of rocks. Oop. Failed to pick up that rock. Which is fair because I was running at the time. Like, if, if I was running and I had to pick up a very small, or a reasonably small... Well, I can't pick any more rocks. Reasonably small rock from the ground, I probably wouldn't have much success either. So, um, I, I accept. I accept that uh, we had trouble one-off collect completing the first section of our nice little wall. I've always wanted a little stone wall in this game. Never took the time to do it. You guys are making me into a better a better player. Uh, you're probably doing that anyway by all the... I'm guessing there'll be lots of comments saying uh, about my inefficiencies. So um, reading those will probably make me a better player as well. Ah, there's one done. One and done. 24 left. I really do want to fight. Maybe we'll just go and look in a cave or something because there's no enemies showing up. I wish there was a way to... Well, actually, there is a way to summon enemies. I can build a bonfire. I think enemies come when you uh, build a bonfire because they can see it from much further. It looks like there's some light over there. Or maybe that's just the reflection. But it does look like there's a, a bit of light by that tree. And I think that is a sacred... Like, well, these these are sacred trees. I've been told, or I've read rather, that... um cannibals will sometimes gather in the trees so all around the trees so I wouldn't be surprised if there's some over there having a religious meeting but I think it tends to be in the mornings hmm 19 more come on I really want to fight it's getting silly I, we've been running around normally, normally we have to hide in our tree by this time it's our bedtime I guess if we don't get any combat, we're just going to go to bed. And if it's going to stay like this, there's no point in having vegetarian mode on. I mean, I want it. I want some fight. I want some, some resistance in my uh, foresting life. This is practically vegan mode. Apart from that, we've got a corpse up. Was that the wind or was that a growl? I think that was the wind. Okay. 14 more rocks. One there. Badmin maxing again. It looks like the sun's rising. It's weird. Okay. Rocks are plenty. Plenty of rocks. Can't carry them any more rocks. I really expected this. I mean, we haven't had anything to do over the night. We usually have to fight, but... Um, 
well, I mean, I was really expecting some enemies to turn up. That's why I, I, mean, I wasn't going to bother collecting rocks. I didn't want to spend all this time collecting rocks. Because uh, it just didn't seem necessary. Like, I, I really thought there would be something to do. Can we only carry five rocks? I mean, it makes sense, but still. Let me get this bunny rabbit. Oh, I did get it. It didn't seem like I got it. Yeah. Daytime. Only one cannibal. Um, okay, then. I guess I'm going to... I'll take a pause and turn on cannibal mode. And then we will use the bones we have to make some armor. And then we'll uh, go and do some caving. I think there's a cave nearby. Or there's at least one cave nearby that I know of anyway. Let's just finish our wall. I mean, why not? Wall not. Wall not. Uh... Oh, I can plant. That was weird. I don't know if we just planted or not. That was strange. Um, yeah, I mean, let's go find a cave and then um, do some caving. So I will join you in a second after I've reset this to the normal mode. Okay, we're back and we're now in meat mode. So we're going to take the opportunity to make our armor. Now a little bowl, a little bone, bone bowl. Are we missing some bones? I thought there was a lot more than that. We're going to make a little bit of armor and then um, go ahead and fight some monsters. Well, we haven't got enough bones to make two pieces. Uh, and we've got a little bit of food, but not really enough water. Um, okay, well, I guess we'll... There was something else I wanted to do before we left, before we... Uh, Went off for a fight. Oh yeah, we're gonna make some cocktails. Molotov cocktails, not not just cocktails. <laughs> I thought we had some stuff that we could use to make bombs, but apparently not. And I'm gonna try. I think there's a you can control. Well, I just drank that by accident. I was gonna say I think you can control click and, and build them on mass, but um, no, nope, just got drunk in the forest, and there are now cannibals. So the nearest cave is over here, and. Our time is almost up for this episode, um, so I'm going to grab these. I'm going to go over there, collect some sticks while we're at it. Oh shit! I should have um, I should have eaten before we left. Uh, <laughs> that's so funny. That's odd that we have to think about those kind of things in a game. Um, yeah, we are going to get to the cave. Maybe we'll go in a little bit. And then we will probably leave it somewhere around there. And next time you will, you will join me or rejoin me as I foray into the dark depths of the cave. 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 Um, trying to add some drama there. Did it work? Are you dramatized? Are you dramatic? I'm dramatic. You're um, bored. Uh, <laughs> I hope not. Uh, maybe you are. I don't know. That was a really boring night. I'm so sorry. I really was expecting some fighting though. I was desperate for it. I was looking for it. And that's not me. I don't usually do that. I think the cave's here. I think they might have missed it. Oh, no. It's further in the forest. Probably shouldn't use up all of our stamina. Oh, I'm going to take this opportunity as well to make a, a torch. A little uh, a little torch because that will keep us warm when we need to, uh, to start fighting. Uh, when we need to um, go in the caves. So the, the torch will it'll give us light, but it'll also keep us warm. Yeah, it's over here. Up on the left, I think. God, I really think they might have changed the uh, changed the map a little bit here. It does seem unfamiliar, but maybe it's just because I haven't been here in a while, you know? Okay, we'll go up here. I'm just gonna I'm letting my stamina regen a little bit. Um, pick up some rocks. Haven't run into any cannibals yet. That's okay though. In fact, that's encouraged. Encouraged for the cannibals to not run into me because um, I'll kill them. Or they'll kill me. Probably probably one or the other. Not both. Hopefully not both. I mean, I'd rather have a tree. Isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it over here? I don't remember this tree being here. Ah, I think this is it. I think it's in these rocks. There we go. 
Oh no, actually, I think this is possibly the worst possible entrance. Um, I remember this drops you into the uh, into the middle of a cave. And really, we want to be going in at the front so that we have a way of backing up. But I don't want to have to find out where we are. Like, spin around and be surrounded. I'd much rather walk in. We might not have that opportunity. Because we'd have to have the front entrance of the cave. Oh, I think, actually, is it in the side here? I really thought it was around here. Okay, well, I guess we're going in the hole. Um... Not really what I was looking to do, but uh, well, desperate times, desperate measures. I'm gonna kill this guy. No, I'm not. That'll show me for being eager to kill a seagull. Okay, we're going down. Going down, 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 down. Oh, God, I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it at all. Oh, I don't like it at all. Maybe I'll leave this episode on the rope. Um, God, I'm such a coward. No, screw it. Just do it. Fuck you! This is my house! It's not, it's your house. Screw you, I'll come into your home and kill you. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, they're fighting themselves, that's good. Actually, what we want. Okay. Don't appreciate the, the giggling. Thank you very much. Just because I'm not wearing any trousers. <laughs> oh, there's... He got up. Back. Back, you beast. Well, we don't need to chop him up or burn him or anything like that. So, let's gather up some resources from this first area. And then um, we'll leave the episode here. And I guess we'll go further into the cave in the near future. Let's got some money. After stabbing that guy. Poor dude. Oof. I don't even like being in the caves when uh, enemies are turned off. I hate it. It's terrifying. It's so creepy. It's so well done. I find it so terrifying. What was that? I think we dropped a stick because we didn't have enough room. Oh, and we found a... Hopefully we can pick up some more... Um more uh, drinking stuff liquid because we have a, a bit of a lack that's the one thing we're going to struggle for we haven't we didn't bring any like cans of liquid uh cans of soda but i think there are some further on in the cave like quite a few oh, there's another passenger god i hate how loud everything is in here it's shame you can't pick up some of these things it'd be nice to take some of this stuff home Decorate our cave with our exploits. There is some cloth off of that corpse. And what was that? Oh, a little Timmy drawing. Oh, I forgot about Timmy. So we have to knock this down to get further on. Okay, come on. Okay, so what we're going to do now is make a hunting shelter in the cave here so that we can save. And uh, I guess we'll leave the episode there. And again, save so, so that we don't have to repeat our pro progress. I think there's enough sticks down here. I saw one stick there. If not, we'll have to go up to the surface and get some. I think that might cause the cannibals to respawn, though. Which is fine. It was only three. There was another stick. 
Um, I think the en the exit's over here, so I guess we'll just go out the exit, get some sticks, and then come back. Actually, there's enough. There should be enough. There's usually some more in the entrance to the cave. I think you need, because you're supposed to use them for torches. Okay, I guess we're going to go outside, grab some sticks, then come back in. I wonder if that'll cause us to despawn. No, it's still there. Uh, not us, the, the cannibals the, and the, the bed. To respawn. God, I'm sorry. Being in these caves really messes me up. I hate it. I'm terrified. It's so stressful. Okay. Yep, yeah, that's a cannibal. I saw him move. Or maybe it was just a box. Okay, we're going to save. And then we are going to leave it here. So join us next time when we go deeper into the caves, deeper than I've ever been before. Um, well, with cannibals turned on. And uh, I will see you next time. Thanks very much. If you enjoyed this episode, leave a comment and don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to. I have been Jester of None. Guns? I thought I saw guns. Don't you usually see guns within 800 meters? Like, don't you usually see the... Yep, yep, you do, you do, you do, you do, you do, you do. Flee, 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 flee. Flee in any direction. <laughs>